Every day, on average, 15 Canadian women pass away because of breast cancer and leave their families and friends behind. If we diagnosed their cancer sooner, we could have saved their lives. The problem is our current method for diagnosing breast cancer are not sensitive and reliable enough for early diagnosis. For example, we cannot see tumors smaller than a specific size by current breast cancer screening tools. Many breast cancer cases stay undiagnosed until it's too late to cure. The main goal of my PhD project is to find specific cancer protein in human blood that will allow us to diagnose breast cancer earlier. I want to save time to save patients' lives. You might ask, why are we looking for cancer protein in blood? I believe Superman's story can help explain that. Superman was from a foreign planet, much like a cancer cell is foreign to our body. Moments before their planet destruction, Superman's parents put their most valuable thing, their baby boy, inside a spaceship and released him to outer space for the sake of his survival. That's how he ended up on Earth. That is similar to what breast cancer cells do. They put their most valuable protein inside very small pouches called vesicles and release them into blood for the sake of their own survival. Once in the blood, these vesicles will be taken up by healthy cells in our body. The cancer protein inside vesicles will convince the healthy cells to support tumor cells to survive, grow, and spread. Healthy cells also release vesicles into blood, but their vesicles do not have such protein and such effects. To get ahead of the tumor growth and spread, we want to detect these protein as soon as possible. And that's where my research comes in. These vesicles are very small, which means we can place one million of them on the tip of a sewing needle. I use a specialized and very sensitive pieces of equipment to detect these very tiny vesicles. I am working on blood samples from breast cancer patients, and I am showing that there is one specific cancer protein inside these vesicles. Then I can compare the blood sample from breast cancer patients to healthy people, and I can show that this specific cancer protein is only and exclusively in breast cancer patients' blood. I am developing a novel blood test which help us to diagnose breast cancer before it's too late. Thank you.